I'm gonna show you how to turn this into this. As you'll see, I'm gonna do this dark green color, the deep forest, yeah, deep forest green. I'm gonna start with this color and I'm gonna spray the whole thing so that way I have a good base coat. And then I'll go back and start filling it in with the browns and the army greens and the blacks. And you just keep going layer over layer over layer. The more layers you do, the better it looks, actually. So. Okay, so I got my tank. It's dry for the most part. I got my leaves. I went ahead and separated every other branch so it's ready. I have good gaps so the paint can go through it and not just make one giant blob. So you want to separate that beforehand. Uh, and you can experiment it. You can take more off. You can take less off if that's the look you're going for. But the key to doing this, it's very, very important that when you put it on, see how it's kind of wanting to stay up in certain spots. If you have it this far away, it's just going to look like a shadow, like you put your hand over it or something. It doesn't look good at all. So the most important thing is that you get it as close as possible. And so I kind of take it and I kind of push it against it like that. It's sticking away a little bit, it's fine. You'll see, experiment with it, you'll find what works best. But for me, if I kind of push it on there like that, and then I just give it a blast, like that. And I'm just gonna go around and kind of do it in different spots. And you want to kind of like mix it up. Don't do the same angle, the same leaf every time. Try to mix it up, different angles. Do it on the handle. It looks cool on the handle. There it is. I think that'll do. That'll do, pig. Pretty easy. You can see all the different dimensions now. Really adds a lot of cool flavor and I really like it. So all you need right here. Rust-oleum paint. Camouflage flat. I think it's all flat. It doesn't say flat. Uh, yeah, it does say ultra flat colors. Use that and get yourself any leaf. I've tried pine needles. Pine needles don't work as good because they're so full. They just kind of made a blob. So use something that's real defined. I think what might look cool too is a palm branch. Put those palm branches on there with the long, whatever you call them, 
palm fronds. Anyways, put those on there. That might look cool. Um, just experiment. Try different branches. And that's all we got today. So, thanks for watching. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.